Hello everyone, it's Marco here again, ready to give you the answers to the motorsport quiz um, from Sporting Memories. So, motorsport quiz question number one was what is the TT stand for in the Isle of Man races? It is, of course, Tourist Trophy. The TT stands for Tourist Trophy. So that's question number one. Number two, we asked you who first had a record-breaking car and boat called Bluebird. And it was, of course, Malcolm Campbell. It was Malcolm Campbell for question number two. Number three. What team did Jim Clark spend all of his career at in Formula One? What was the name of the team? Lotus. So Jim Clark spent all of his career with the Lotus team. Number four. How many times did... Sterling Moss win the World Drivers' Championship? And the answer, of course, is none. He never won the world title. He won many Grand Prix, but he never actually won the World Championship. That's number four. Number five. Which ex-world champion was tragically killed in the San Marino Grand Prix in May 1994? And it was, of course, the legend himself, Ayrton Senna. Number five, the answer is Ayrton Senna. Number six, who was the first man to design his own car and then win with that same car in the Grand Prix? It was, of course, Jack Brabham. And the answer is, for number six, Jack Brabham. Number six. Question number seven. In 1994, who was the first Austrian to win the German Grand Prix since Nicky Lauda? And the answer was Gerhard Berger. Gerhard Berger is for number seven. Number eight, which Britain was the first World Drivers' Champion to win Le Mans in 1972? And it was Graham Hill. Graham Hill, the first Britain to win the World Drivers' Champion in Le Mans in 72. Graham Hill. Number nine. By the end of 2005, which rider had won the most World Superbike titles? And it was, of course, Foggy, otherwise known as Carl Fogarty. So number nine, Carl Fogarty is your answer. Number ten. When did the Superbike World Championships begin? And it was 1988. Question 10, the answer is 1988. Number 11, which bike did the 2004 250cc Grand Prix world champion Daniel Pedrosa ride? And it was, he rode Honda. Pedrosa rode Honda. Number 12, which Italian legend won 15 motorcycle Grand Prix championship titles? And it was, of course, Agostini. So number 12, the answer is Agostini. So that moves us on now. You should be on question 13 now. And the question is, which 1960s Formula One driver was known as King of Monaco or just Mr. Monaco? And it was Graham Hill. So that's two answers we've had on this quiz that have been Graham Hill. Number 14. Whose tyre exploded with just 16 laps to go in the 1986 Australian Grand Prix, which potentially cost him the World Championship? And it was, of course, the great Nigel Mansell. Number 14, it is Nigel Mansell. Now, question 15, which has got a few different answers. Which three prestigious motor races make up the Triple Crown of motorsport? Which three prestigious races, motor races, make up the triple crown of the sport? And they are as follows. Number one, the Indianapolis 500, IndyCar. The 24 Hours of Le Mans, Endurance Racing. And of course, the Monaco Grand Prix for Formula One. So just to repeat, it was the Indianapolis 500, IndyCar. The 24 Hours of Le Mans, Endurance Racing. And of course the Monaco Grand Prix for Formula One. And just as an extra little 
um, fact. Graham Hill is the only driver ever to have won the Triple Crown. Graham Hill. So I hope you've enjoyed that quiz on motorsport. I hope you did well. And also, more importantly, that you enjoyed our little journey through a bit of motorsport nostalgia. Some great names there, some great legends, both in the modern era and obviously 40, 50 years ago plus. Um, and I hope you've enjoyed that. And I look forward to bringing the next quiz next week. All right, so bye-bye for now.